Good evening, chaps and chapettes. Robbie here, and welcome to Nosferatu, the Wrath of Malachi. Picked up this off Steam just because it was on cheap. Unfortunately, I missed that uh, free key, key giveaway that was on a little while ago. But frankly, come on, it's va it's vampires are shooting vampires, and even it better, it's a retro game. Retro, as in the actual sense of it came out a while ago, not as in the developers didn't have the cash for a decent physics engine, so they just shut stuff down on the cheap. But before we give it any kind of golden seal, let's have a look and see what we got. Uh, easy medium nightmare. Mm. Tempted as I always am by difficulty levels with a nice fancy name. Mm, possibly not the best start. So let's go for medium. No, ooh. Ooh, things went a little bit wibbly there for a second. Oh, don't crash. Come on. I know the rig I'm running you on is kind of futuristic compared with what you were designed for, but come on. Come on, old girl. Hello? Oh, oh crap, was that my mic? Good. Okay, cut. Oh, thank goodness. Cutscene. I thought things were going seriously wrong there for a second. Hello? Can I help you, or...? Now that's an evil looking beard. That's an evil looking pair of tits. Yeah. There was something about old On a misty glasses. October night in the Transylvanian mountains, you arrived to join your family and some of their closest friends at Castle Malachi, where your sister Rebecca is to be wed to the son of the wealthy Romanian Count. Ooh, party! Dibs on the cake. Arriving a day later than your family, you're thrilled about the reunion and the festivities that will follow. Of However, course I am. as the coach taking you from the train station hurries through the fog towards the dark and ominous looking castle, you get a horrible feeling that everything is not what it is supposed to be. Horrible feelings or no, when you're invited to a wedding at a flipping castle, you go to the wedding. Doesn't matter if the people there you absolutely As despise. As the coach drops you off at the castle gates, you're left alone in the dark, your torch barely illuminating the large blackened gates in front of you. My name An Carby? icy wind sends a horrifying chill through your bones as you manage to push the massive gates open. Walking through the vault mind, towards the empty castle plaza, you prepare yourself for the worst. God help us all. Drama! Seriously, just because you haven't got a flipping welcoming party does not mean everyone's dead. I mean, we've all made that mistake, but hey. Ooh. You went to an old stone egg courtyard fronting a huge ancient castle. You must rescue your family. Press tab to have a look at them. Ah, oh, rescue mission. Straight from the up. <laughs> Look at Grandad's photo. Now that's a Grandad you do not mess with. I've got a Tommy gun and I'm standing on the head of what looks like either a cow or an eldritch abomination. Either way, probably went into the Happy Meals. Right. Oh, there was one thing I learnt from the controls. Invert mouse. Y yes, yes, I am one of those weirdos. I must invert this, otherwise it just doesn't feel right. Okay, East Wing Main Courtyard. West Wing. Ooh. Ooh, political drama. No. Be boring. Ooh, Jay Patterson's. I apologise, Mr. Patterson. I will be stealing your stuff. Ooh. Found my cane sword. Which is in dire need of a clean. Good lord, man. What did you stab last with this? Oh no. I beg his pardon. Just the trick of the light. Okay. When in doubt, main steps, I guess. Wow, be a hell of a rave going on in there. Look at those lights. Quite impressive. Look. Oh, when was, was this? Was this like two thousand five? I think this came out. Okay, maybe not a rave. Um, wait. Okay, thought abandoned by creepiness. Ooh, quick oh. Will you knock it off? Hello, Moon. Goodbye, Moon. Here. 
Use the crucifix on water to make it holy. Okay. Okay. I mean, come on, it's, it's called Nosferatu. Of course there's going to be flipping vampires, but this guy doesn't know that. When was the last time you looked at a puddle of water and just thought, hmm, I could turn this into a weapon? And see if this last time you did was kind of recent. Please, for the love of God, man, seek help. Okay, good, I seem to have my own personal light source. Kind of, sort of. Ooh, what's it? Okay, don't think I'll be going this way just yet. That's a little bit ominous. Okay. So he says, maybe it's not a rave, maybe it's not a weird sex party, which considering this is a wedding my family, dear God, star, oh, oh, brain, why do you do that to me? Maybe it's just a... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, bad doggy, bad, bad, bad. Okay, vampire dogs. Um, no, seriously, where the hell did that thing come from? Hmm. Methinks this is not going to be the kind of party I enjoy. Ooh, this is not. Ooh, nice revolver, mini hopper. Ah. ah, don't know if you just glanced down that at the bottom left. See, no, not the very dour face of presumably me. Ooh, I really, really need to get a tan. But the health meter just beside it, well, I'm guessing it's a health meter, quickly just went up to, when I grabbed that health pack, went up to 102 and then ticked back down. So it looks like it's. Ah! So it looks like there's a game mechanic of. So let's see, experiment number one. Oh, yeah. So you can't store up health, nor do you keep it as items. It's a good old fashioned, you run over it, you pick it up with your feet. I'm presuming all of the old game, old game protagonists, they must have had prehensile toes or something to do that. Hello! Oh, James! Hello! The pain! I can't take it much longer. Please, bring Dr. Amersfield. Ooh! Ooh, is this a time limit? You don't know when you came sanctuary. Dr. Amersfield from the East Wing. Okie doke, and follow the green lit hallways. Okie doke. Wow. You are having a bad time. Right, uh, to the East Wing then, I guess. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Apparently the power of Christ compels you to shoot lightning bolts. Oh, who am I kidding? I'm going to go for this. Mm. Wait, is this green? Yeah, this is green. This might be the right way. Oh, ah! Oh, Christ compels you, bitch! Wow. Well, seriously, first ending with the game, he was a tough bugger. Ammunition for a revolver. I haven't actually got a gun yet. Small health back, good. Big health back, better. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, hello. You alright, love? Ooh, no, you don't look alright. Jesus, Agent Christ! Wow. Okay, think I might be getting one of these for my pad, because seriously, that's kind of powerful for just a lump of, I don't know, silver? Oh, looks kind of expensive. Okay, so what's the net result there? Ammunition for weapons I do not have. And... That's about it, really. Ammo for a revolver. I would dearly like the actual revolver itself. Hey, uh, do you have the key? No? See yourself then. I'm going to help it. It's, it's a nice one, but I need the key. So, keep wandering in doors, I guess. Okay, not green lit. I have a feeling this might be the wrong way. Oh, hello. Oh, Christ! No way! Oh, no, wait, you're human. Kind of, sort of. What the hell? 
Holy crap, I died! Oh, nuts! Okay, uh... Yeah, that wasn't really anything got to do. He had a flipping gun and I had nothing. It's a full health as well, criminy. Okay, human beings slightly more dangerous than vampires in this then. Okay, right, um... Did I... Oh, nerds. Didn't save. Oh well. Back in a tick. And yes, I am going to pussy out. God, I'm peasants. Learn their place. Right, okay, here we go. Try number two. Right. Okay, as I said, easy mode, so hopefully that should make it better. And... JERG! Yeah, that's what the feck? Oh, for the love of... Right! Try the third! And before I do it this time, I shall try flipping saving. Cool, never realise how much you flipping rely on auto saves nowadays. Right, okay. So uh, I was right in going for the guy with the gun. That makes sense. I just need to then bob and weave with the other two kids. Right. Damn it! Okay, another thing discovered. That little bar just be uh, below, even above my rather devilishly handsome face. Watch as I swing. It's a fatigue meter! Hooray! Right. This might just be a good old fashioned. There we go. Oh, that's much better. Oh, and dare I? Oh, yes. Have I? Come on. Oh, no, no. Did not want to do the mouse thing. I wanted. Have a look at my new toy. Flintlock, but better than now. Oh, doggy! Hello, doggy! You're an ugly mutt. I think I'll let you out anyway, because you don't look ugly enough to actually be trying to bite my nuts off. Or maybe the music is telling me I'm wrong, but hey. Okay. Come on, finding loads of ammo for a flipping revolver. No actual revolver. Come on, even, even on flipping easy, this is actually proving to be a little bit of a challenge. Might prove good, might prove bad. Hmm. Alright. So I found dog, gun. Okay. Have we got a flick? Just realised actually from what that. Uh, from the. Uh, hold on. Father, papery guy. Yeah, Mr. Wounded over down there. Yeah. We've got a bit of a time limit going on here, so we've got half an hour to try and save him. Questioning kind of why. But alright. Uh, but he's supposed to be my friend, because this is very much a game of tell, don't show. Ooh, thank you very much. Oh, kind of creepy. Gotta admit, I ain't kind of liking the atmosphere. I don't know if that's supposed to be a film grain over the top of everything. It does add to the atmosphere. It does give it kind of a B-movie vibe. Right. Let's have a look see around it. Because wasn't there that room down here I didn't go into? Maybe that's got the key to the east wing in it. Because that's where the guy, that's where the father, uh, Ted, said everything was. Or at least the friends I'm supposed to save are. So... Yeah, let me just have a quickie save, because I have a feeling this is going to go badly for me. Okay, very B-movie. What we got here? Oh, encyclopedia. Okay, so just a little explanation of the NMIs there. I'm guessing Ghoul would be the. Hey! It's not my grave yet. I'm guessing. The ghouls. Maybe they're guarding the key in here. 
Apparently it can spawn anywhere, so have a quick look at the grounds. Come on. More stuff all. Ooh, shadow vampires. Do 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 do. Uh, you can read. Read it yourself. Okay, so we got generic grunt type, we got ambush type, we've got and the classic Nosferatu, which was that one that did the whole rising out of the grave. What the fuck? Okay, we do have actual zombies now, apparently, because no, there was actual Resident Evil noises out right there. Okay, and they weak, they be weak hitters. That's kind of good. Oh, this is going to be one of the. There's lots of them. Deals. Yeah, I can, I can deal with them. Certainly seems to be enough health packs knocking around at the moment. Ooh. Creepy tree. Okay, so this is clearly an area to come back to later. Oh, no, no, damn it, brothers. Hmm. Okay, think I'll come back here um, sometime never. I us grab that flicking health pack. Have you forgot an old game? I'm gonna make kind of impressed with the load times right now. Seriously, went to a new area, it was a very quick loading screen. Again, the whole it has been remastered. I say remastered. It is, this was from GOG. Good old GOG. Seriously, how can you not love GOG? I mean, okay, you can maybe love, not love the fact that you don't tend to have... Oh, come on, you pussy. That wasn't anything. Ooh, crucifix on the water. Okay, don't. Yeah, I, I, as I was saying, going back to just the well, this game is, I say 2005. That's literally just off the top of my head because that's it's got all got that you know mid two th mid noughties level of graphics. But come on, I need the. F okay, so this is the West Wing. Maybe there's the key. <laughs> Maybe the key for the East is in the West. So if it's not, there's the boards the bridge. That'd be the word I'm looking for. That's not up. Okay. Come on, I'm wasting... Ooh, I've nearly wasted ten minutes. <laughs> ten, ten minutes plus all those flipping deaths. Yeah, look, if you had the key, just give it to me. Or is this going to be one of the ones where I completely overlook the very, very obvious key? Oh, shut up. I can't have just been the... It's only going to my nerves, me. <laughs> More so than usual. It kind of just been just the gun here. Okay, so Aunt Sophie's cage key. Okay, this is why you don't bother to really lock anything except your own front door. So otherwise you just forget where all the flipping keys are. Or oh, passwords, whatever. Keep it simple, but keep it weird. You know, like you have to find several crests to unlock a door. You know, Res Resident Evil logic. Because there is no logic, no one will think of what its meanings. Of course, what I actually meant to say was which might help in English. Rog, Gordon Bennett, you bloody idiot. So, oh, no, no such luck. Was to, um, was to thing. Okay, train of thought is over there somewhere. So screw it. Let's, let's find this damn key, Hansen. I might cut away if I'm wandering around for a little bit trying to find it. So actually, what I will just do is I'll save because otherwise, this chap, not going to have a good day just because I'm trying to find a mm, key. Okay, welcome back everyone. I finally found the key, and guess how it works? This key, which is necessary to even begin the game, randomly spawns in one of the side rooms of this here courtyard, and I found it over this bridge, which was hereby broken by performing a running leap of faith after, according to my clock, 15 minutes of titting around getting absolutely nowhere. Let me just reiterate. The key 
which is necessary to start the game is a random spawn. What hell? Oh, forget it. Ah, oh, but it was. Apart from the fact I finally got the key that allows me to begin the game, I found out two good things. One, these chests randomly spawn whatever's inside them. So that might have killed the game for me. Secondly, the best weapon I have at the moment is, in fact, my fists. Because I am apparently playing as Bruce Lee. So let me just demonstrate with this chap here. Come on, you. Come on. Where are you? Oh, yeah. Bitchin'. I'm presuming these are the ghouls, but who cares? Just Bruce Lee, your ass, you ugly mofo. And, uh, oh yeah, uh, I checked down there in the interim. There is absolutely nothing. That's all. Yet. But, again, we are on the clock. I spent five of the... What did he say? He said he had half an hour or so? Right. So we've got to search this portion of the house here and find... Hopefully, the Doctor, not that Doctor, because that would be awesome, but a Doctor we would help. Oh, and see, the greenery, right. Not 100% sure what time this episode will roll down to, considering all that mucking around I did to find the damn key. But I think I will leave it here. I think what I'll do is I'll actually make this one a full playthrough, because aside from that nonsense with that key... I'm actually quite liking this one so far. Not more so, I'd still say so far from what I've played, Dementium 2 is probably my favourite, but as as an aside, that has proven to be a bit of a bugger to record. So I'm going to make this part one of um, hopefully not too many. It doesn't seem like a very big level, but if it's going from the good bits so far, this could be really entertaining, well, uh, for me at least. So anyway, thank you all very much for watching. For waffing? For watching even! Thank you all very much for watching indeed. Have a look see down below, see if there's anything else I've done which takes your eye. If so, by have a look, by all means, by all means, my friends, as and as always, people, please be wonderful to each other. A good night. <laughs>